an emotional return for Dallas's former top cop. Last night, David Brown made an appearance at the Winspear Opera House as a civilian and public speaker. Jeff Paul spoke with him about the challenges he's faced both professionally and personally. Speaking to a crowd of the people he used to serve, former police chief David Brown made his return to the public spotlight to the city he loves and calls home. Brown started the night not by talking about his new memoir, but by recognizing a mother in the audience who lost her son in the Dallas ambush. Can we all stand and recognize Mrs. Zemarippa? The former DPD chief so spent the evening on the stage of the Winspear Opera House detailing his today. most intimate moments included Our in his new book meaning. called To Rise. Before I was very private. And I was intentionally private because I was, I've been grieving. Brown spoke of his son who shot and killed a civilian and police officer before being shot and killed as well. He also relived the night he lost four of his own officers and a dart officer. Brown says he doesn't regret using a robot to blow up shooter Micah Johnson. I, I was not willing to lose a sixth or a seventh officer or eighth officer trying to end this season. Among the audience, 90-year-old Jim Lavelle. He, like Brown, was law enforcement for a historic moment in Dallas. Lee Harvey Oswald was handcuffed to him as Jack Ruby shot JFK's assassin during transport. I thought he did a great job with uh, handling the situation when the officers got shot, and I admire him for that. Brown also didn't shy away from the current climate involving controversial police-involved shootings, saying the stereotypes only divide us. They are black cops and white cops and Hispanic cops that shouldn't be cops. Mm -hmm. And so this stereotyping doesn't work mm -hmm. no matter where you sit. I just happen to be black and blue. In Dallas, I'm Jeff Paul, CBS 11 News.